going. All right, real talk. Take blowing up because <laughs> we're just blowing up right now. Really? We're slowly sweeping the nation. Yeah. Taking over your street, running the block. Taking over the streets. Saying. Now we in the slab. Literally about like, to take over the streets. <laughs> it was because we were driving around, and we decided since it was going to be Thanksgiving that we had to give y'all a preview, something to something to bask in while it's Thanksgiving holiday. And something to be thankful for. Exactly. And we are all thankful for MySpace. Real yeah, talk. Real talk. But, you know, there's some things about MySpace, you know, that just grind my gears, and... I know, and I'm gonna let Edric start because I can just murk this like right now. Well, we, can murk it 24/7. we can murk it 24 7. We can murk it 24 7, 365. Any day of the week. Uh, you know what I'm saying, but. I mean, this one, this one is because of special requests from you guys as our fans. As our fans. We have received a lot of messages and whatnot that said that you wanted us to murk MySpace, and I was like, nah, that's too easy, nah. But for Thanksgiving, we're gonna murk it for you guys. All right, real talk. I want to start off. First of all, should we start with Tom? Since Tom, he's, Tom, he's your first friend. This fool, is fucking, <laughs> this fool is your first friend, fool. He brings you into the MySpace world. I mean, this guy <laughs> is like analogous, almost to Jesus. Yeah, I'm not I'm gonna, gonna go that, that far. Yeah. You know, he's like a preacher. Hey, folks. Uh, you know, the bulletins are down. Thank you, he's Tom. Your, he's your first message Thank you, that Tom. you get when you sign up for MySpace. First message. That's a beautiful thing, Tom. But, Tom, who the fuck are you? <laughs> really? What is your last name, Tom? <laughs> oh, my like God. Know. Your name is just Tom. What do you do on the weekend? Is it Thomas? Is it Tommy? I swear those fucking pictures <laughs> on your, uh, uh, in your albums are Photoshopped. Because your face them. is the fucking same in all of them. <laughs> I swear you just crop your head out and just shift this shit over. And this brings us to another thing about people's pictures. When people be putting nasty ass pictures on their MySpace, trying to look all fun and stuff. Okay, here's one, here's a scenario right here. When you got a fat ass bitch taking a picture and she looks skinny as fuck. Oh, yeah. it's, like, it's like, bitch, I've seen you in person, I know you personally. You are not this skinny. How do you look so skinny in your pictures? Real talk. How fine do they get, though, fool? Yeah, they, they do be getting looking fans fine. and, like, blowing their hair and shit. <laughs> looking like models, models doing all shit. the makeup. Real talk. And then you make it black and white. <laughs> <laughs> or you make it Cover fuzzy everything. and shit in the background. <laughs> or you do the one where it's, like, reverse colors and shit. <laughs> you make this shit look crunk as fuck like you're a cartoon. <laughs> oh, man. But seriously, back to Tom. I mean, I'm not done with this fool. How this fool is just now making MySpace crunk yeah. after like four fucking years. Four years he's, of having he's now that old ass homepage with old squares around all this shit, looking all like Windows 98 and shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, like, and just and now, now he brought just... us up to XP and shit in the year 2007. Fool. And then like, what did this shit start in like 2000? It started in 2000, and then it, they like took it off because it wasn't crunk. Right. And then it started in like 2003. Because that's when everybody had Xangas. And then it's Xangas, <laughs> whatever the fuck you call them. And then, the, and then this bitch sold it for, like, half a billion dollars. But, like, uh, I mean, he's just now making the message clicky icon. Now they're rounded. I mean, that shit is, I don't he's know. bringing us up to Windows XP. And now you got the say. comment back button. How Real fucking talk. amazing is that? I mean. That shit works for me. Saves so much time. Real I used talk. to click on their picture. And then when people scroll all the way the fuck down. All the stuff on their profiles that be lagging out your computer and stuff. <laughs> Real talk. And now you can nobody wants to see that. And now you can load like multiple pictures. This shit goes into your files so you can see all the pictures. You click the ones you want and then you just download them. It takes long as fuck if you do like a whole bunch of pictures, but <laughs> they're still crap. Yeah, you don't have to do the whole process where you upload your shit to Photo Bucket, then put it on your MySpace. <laughs> I know you know what I'm talking about. You know you know oh. what I'm talking about, because you did it too. But but Real one talk. thing, Tom fucking pissed me off. Me and Edric were talking about this the other day. Let fucking him know. top 1000s and shit. Top 1000s. Like, it started with like top Real 8. Talk. We was like crunk. That's crunk. And top 16. Oh, you can get all the friends oh, that you really kind of like that are getting pissed off because they on your top 8. Yeah. But now it's like top 64. Now this bitch has like top all. And like all your fucking <laughs> friends are on your thing. And they're like, am I on your top? Yeah, fool. You like 268. Look, <laughs> number 
268. Bitch, look. I don't want to see all your friends on your top list. If I wanted to see all your friends, I'll click view all friends. <laughs> Real talk. But when I'm when I see somebody's profile and it has a fucking top 64. I'm not going to call any names out because I'm not going to put anybody on blast what? like that. But real talk, when you have a Hurt top 64, too. you better have me on that shit. shit bull. Real talk, or I'll delete you as my friend because that's some fraud ass shit if I'm not on your top 64. If he can't be on your top 64, if he can't be your friend on MySpace, real talk. can he be your friend in real life? Because you hey, got yeah. bands and shit. I know what you're talking about. When people be having bands, bands and shit. on your top 8 as your number 2, like you nigga, they're not your number 2 friend. They are not your friend. Real talk, you do not know them personally. Maybe you got an autograph. Maybe you went to the concert. You might have a t-shirt, for goodness sakes. But you do not have them as your best friend. Yeah, just because this bitch le fuck. lets you on stage. Fucking, I know you're going to love them, but damn, they ain't your top friend. That hurts, Real dude. talk. That cuts me deep. That cuts me deep whenever I see one of my best friends and they got fucking bands instead of having me or some, just a real-ass person on their top. Yeah, real talk. a real person having cartoons and shit. What the fuck? <laughs> All right, let's talk about Bulletin Wars. Bulletin Wars. Bulletin Wars. Oh, shit. shit. Bulletin Wars.